The question in this problem is to determine whether this sequence converges or diverges, and if it converges, find the limit. So you can do this intuitively, or you can do this and show work. So intuitively, the cosine of 2n is bounded by 1. That means it's between negative 1 and 1. The bottom is getting really, 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 really big. So you have a number that's between negative 1 and 1. And then up on the bottom, something's getting big. So this gets closer and closer to 0, so the answer is converges to 0. If you wanted to show the work, you could use the squeeze theorem for sequences. You would start down by writing down cosine of 2n, and that's less than or equal to 1 and greater than or equal to negative 1. Then you want to make this look like your sequence. So you divide everything by 3 to the n. And the intuition here is that this goes to 0, this goes to 0, so whatever's trapped in the middle also goes to 0. So all we have to do is say that. So we take the limit of the left-hand side. So it's negative 1 over something that's getting really, really, really big. So this is 0. We take the limit of the right-hand side. So it's 1 over something that's getting really, 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 really big. So this is 0. So thus, by the squeeze theorem, Whatever's trapped inside, which is our original sequence, cosine 2n over 3 to the n also goes to 0. So the answer is that it converges, and the limit in this case is 0. That's it.